Hey y'all, so I am a very much frustrated gardener right now. Um, if any of y'all see my post last night and this morning, you will see that earwigs have taken over my crops. Okay, I'm literally in the transplanting stages. Uh, a lot of my crops I have started in February from seed by myself in my house the grow lights everything self-taught myself you know through youtube and just you know just educating myself and everything and it i will say this much it's super super i was crying yesterday and i have to be honest i was ready to give up but i'm not giving up uh, I'm definitely not giving up. I put way too much, first off, way too much money is spent. I pay for everything. I pay for good soil. I pay for good seeds. I pay for all the things I have to grow these seeds in. Every single thing y'all see in my videos, I pay for that. And I, um, I'm not going to, I kind of, you know, just have to look at it with life. You know, there's always going to be some hiccup. You know, I'm going through hiccups right now and you literally just have to push through it and that's just what it is. But I mean, just to see come out on my porch and just to see, you know, my lettuce and my spinach just being decimated, like they just going ham. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like just living their best lives eating my stuff my hard work going to waste so i'm gonna show y'all right quick what's happening this is what i'm doing to my spinach um i will show you i'm gonna show you what i did to my lettuce that they destroyed there are some other things that they did destroy but the lettuce and the spinach is what they they really been tackling so i um i'm going to head out uh, cause I ran out of oil. I'm going to get oil. I'm going to do oil. I'm going to put it in a container and a couple of containers on my porch and, um, uh, with some soy sauce. And we're going to see what that does. I've seen people's videos and it seems like it's, you know, it helps or whatever. I got the neem oil. The neem oil ain't doing nothing for this. I don't know what's going on. You know, I mean, between the, the smoke coming, uh, taking over the world and all kinds of stuff happening. And yeah, you know, I don't know what I'm saying. Um, uh, I'm not going to stop growing my food just because you got these bugs or whatever want to come and try to kill, steal, and destroy. We're not doing that. That's what's not happening. We're not doing that. So I'm going to show y'all right quick um, what I had to, I had to cut this down and it really, it hurt. It hurt because I grew these from seeds. I grew these from seeds. Anyway, I'm going to show y'all. So this is my Fort Hook. Uh, romaine lettuce I struggled to get like take down the other two parts right there um wow that's crazy I don't know what kind of bug or spider that is over there I know y'all see that like they're just uh, they just they just I can't make this up um yeah and he on a creep mode it's giving back up Sasha and so y'all see right here that I cut it. Yeah. So, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yeah. I put cayenne pepper in there, which I've already been doing that. The cayenne pepper, the cinnamon. I'm annoyed. You know, it takes time to grow things from seeds. There's a few plants that I have, um, like my eggplant, a couple, I have a couple, maybe one jalapeno plant that I have purchased from a store. My onion uh, slips over here, I purchased those from Walmart. Um, my point is I purchased some things, everything else I grew from seed back earlier this winter. It, 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 listen it's heartbreaking i don't know how other people and i'm new to this but i'm not giving up i'm not giving up it's just it hurts a lot it hurts a lot to you know i'm trying to grow 
uh, for my family. I'm alert. I'm aware. I'm woke. Whatever you want to call it. And I know what's going on um, in this world currently. Like right now. Well before this happened. <clears throat> I know what's going on in this world. And it is important for us to. It's it's so easy to take some seeds or regrow something that you brought from the store. It is so easy to do that. And I'm going to continue to grow my food. I don't care about these bugs. I done been through um, <laughs> I done been through some things. My testimony is great, okay. And I'm still going through things as we all are. And my uh, message to anyone who else out there who is uh, considering gardening, please do it. Um, it's trial and error, like life. It's like, oh man, I messed up on that. Okay, next, keep going, do it over, try again. That's literally what it is. Um, and it, if you don't have patience, but you really want to do it, it teaches you how to have patience. I mean, even if you don't have patience, you will learn patience. If it's really something that you want to do, you will learn patience. Um, you have to have patience, okay? Because it takes time for certain flowers to flowers to germinate and all of that and show itself with the color pop and whatnot example being i'm gonna show y'all this i planted these bulbs i can't remember it sometime early spring spring after the last frost i would say so that one's thriving that one is burnt by the sun okay but they both been doing well thus far those are two jesters um one's gonna be pink bulb one's yellow i don't know which one is who but yeah so i mean the weather i'm in zone 6b the weather has not been that great a lot of my t most of my t tomato plants are not thriving the way they should be thriving so it's just a lot of upset going on it's a lot of aggravation um again this is where patience comes in okay this is where why am i doing this comes in um yeah so i'm not gonna be too long on this i'm already seven minutes into this but i just needed to show y'all that this is this is what i'm dealing with all right so this is my spinach y'all see that like like who, what are we doing with this okay i literally stood out here last night and watched them stupid airwaves go ham on this spinach I was in tears. I'm when I I'm not joking. I was I was crying is because when I seen my first seed that I ever sold and when I seen something growing, I was like ecstatic like, "Oh my goodness, Sasha, you did that." Super proud of myself. I don't know if other uh farmers, gardeners or whatever, I don't know if y'all if y'all feel that way um uh, on y'all journey going through this and doing this and starting this or whatever. But that's 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 my testimony and that's how I felt. And it's just heartbreaking to just see something that you really believe in, you stand by, um, you want to do, you love doing, go to shreds. You know what I'm saying? So, like, that's just really where my mental was last night. But I'm good. I'm going to still keep... I'm, ain't nobody giving up over here. I'm just... I'm being honest. And I'm always going to do my best to be honest with y'all. Um, or, you know, just in life. I try to do my best to do that. And this is what it is. I showed y'all my lettuce earlier, okay? And I had to cut that down. I was scared about cutting the rest of them down. is because even the ones I cut down, like uh, they were actually much bigger. And it just, I was upset. I was upset. Because it was pretty much ready to harvest. I could have harvested a lot off of it. Those ones, too. Um, and just, just to see that. So I have to really, I'm going to do a lot of research tonight and dive more into what I got going on. Again, I'm going to show y'all something else. I had a whole bunch of spinach down here. They ate it. Okay. Uh, when I, when I say ate it, ate it. They, this is what they're doing. Y'all see that? This is a broccoli. Okay. That's what they're doing. This is to shreds. They're like, <laughs> you don't need that. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, you don't need that. So these are coming out of here. Bye-bye. Because we're not wasting time. I am going to be planting more things and getting ready for my fall harvest, as y'all should be doing the same. <laughs> okay? Uh, I'm not giving up. I'm just sharing my story with y'all and let, letting y'all know 
you're gonna go through it too and it's just a part of life just a hiccup any which way y'all be blessed thank you for watching and listening please like comment and definitely subscribe um i hope this manifested with somebody and appreciate y'all